hi guys welcome or welcome back to my channel it's your girl chanel what's up we are rocking the natural hair right now <laughs> and we are off to the movies are you ready now tell me have you all seen our favorite show well i'm gonna say our favorite because i love a good action film so we are heading off to south park which is the next place i have not been to in years but we are going to see transformers yay now here's the thing naya hooked me up with a free site i told you all about it already where it is i you know watch my movies and stuff like that and i saw it plus i've been looking at clips on youtube like on tiktok like anywhere i could see it i have been seeing it i practically know like all of the words they're going to say <laughs> i know right but yet still i was just like yeah we go into the uh cinema yeah definitely we're going so we're going for a little cousin slime it's just gonna be my daughter naya and i and our two cousins and we're going to South Park. I'm excited. I really love how aesthetically pleasing South Park is. Like, every time I come here, I forget because it's like every couple of years that we come here. Most times we would go to like Movie Town in Port of Spain. Um, I actually got recognized. Ooh, one of the cashes was just like, you do TikTok? And I was like, yeah, girl. But anyway, this is my flat outfit and it was such a vibe. So the next day I'm picking up some packages and of course... this is for you <laughs> now y'all i'm not kidding this vlog is gonna have a lot of food are you seeing this roti right now this is from a juman's roti shop in Kirep. look let me tell you about juman's you want shrimp on a roti this is just the ending of the roti and look how much shrimp there's like ten thousand shrimps in this roti like i i love them they never minge on the taste all right and we love that and now I'm going to be trying out this Makeup Revolution Super Fix Super Hold Setting Spray. It has aloe and vitamin E. It's supposed to be super ultra matte. So I am heading out, getting dressed for work, and I thought I would try it. Yes, I nearly sprayed it into my eyes, but it has a very weird spray. But I make sure that I always, you know, dry my face with my little mini fan from Amazon link in my amazon storefront and now my dad and i are off to my nail appointment yes we're heading to do my nails i'm excited Okay, so we are at Beautiful Bliss Nail Bar. This is my nail artist. She is located in Montrose and Shokonas. She actually put on this cool movie on Netflix called The Perfect Fine with Gabrielle Union. Like, I was living and loving it. It's such, like, a cool rom-com if you're into that kind of thing. I mainly like action movies, but I do love a good rom-com, especially with black people, all right? But yeah, it really has a good storyline and was very funny. So now we are going to do the nails. Of course, you'll know I had no idea what it is I wanted to do. But I'm thinking to myself, I want to be different. You all know me. Every set has got to be different. It's got to be unique. So, of course, we knew we wanted to do something with chrome. And I have so many choices here. So I'm just like, oh my gosh, which one do I go with? But while I was decided, you know, deciding, sorry, she continued the process. Latoya is such a boss when it comes to this. She finished this in like two hours or less and i still got to go to work after right because you know we ain't playing with our days so yeah we are actually going to be trying a different nail shape we're gonna go with the almond nail shape i was very intrigued by it because when i was checking on pinterest the style that i really wanted in a chrome effect was best i find on chrome sorry on almond shape nails let me know what you think and i just wanted to do like a pop you know i just I need that kind of vibe that and a, a phone case that matches with it like i'm just seeing the looks in my head yes i'm a weird person but yeah i'm excited all right can't wait for you all to see the ending it was a very nice easy style so this is what it's looking like yes we have silver chrome nails in an almond shape let me know what you think 
So later on that evening, the family and I decided to go out. <laughs> they were being all embarrassed, but here I am looking like a crazy person with my night cream on outside. But we decided to get some ice cream from Wendy's. My mother really wanted some ice cream. We actually tried to go to the um, Eddie Hart Savannah place, the food place, but they were not there, which is weird because it's a Thursday. But listen, this is all... I don't know, ice cream milkshake thing that Wendy's has going on is really good. So yeah, like I said, there's going to be a lot of food in this vlog. So this is actually Friday and we are in the line for Starbucks. My sister really likes their refreshing drinks. I can't remember what it's called, but it is really nice and it's kind of fruity. I like that kind of vibe because I'm not a coffee person. So this was definitely it for us. And... Like, I kid you not, TJ, I was kind of pumping on the other side. This is the Trinity branch, by the way. But yeah, it was a cool vibe. But y'all know me. We got to get us some Sammy's and Aruka. Like, listen, I swear, well, I mean, it's month then, So it had like the entire universe there, but I did not care. Okay, Sammy's can never go wrong. And let me show you why. Look at this. The only thing is though, Naya went ham on the pepper. But other than that, it's yummy. Okay. Mm. And yes, guys, I'm sorry, but the natural hair vibe, I don't know what else to do, like besides putting my hair in one. So I called over my hairdresser. I'm like, girl, come rescue me. So she came over and we are getting a cane roll. This has been my hairdresser for years. That's Arlene. Shout out to her. I purchased some of these stocking caps for my wings and I'm getting ready for church the next day. It is now Sunday. I wanted to do like a full get ready with me, you know, for TikTok, but the timing wasn't working. And you're like, kid you not, I'm wearing this wig right now. And the heat, the heat is on a different level. But, you know, I digress. We're just going to keep it pushing. I was going to do like a lazy eyebrow thing here because I couldn't find my spoolie. Like when I'm feeling hot, like nothing seems to work for me. But say what, we're using one of those brown stocking caps i really wanted this one because i don't actually have to you know put any foundation on the stocking caps if i bought like my actual skin tone because my skin tone is a little bit lighter so this is quite perfect if you ask me and yes yeah, so look at my nails my nails are popping pop lack and drop it i am living for the silver tips in this almond so i am going to be using my bold hold glue i have not used this product in some months and it's actually very very good it is a white creamy uh wig glue but it's very long lasting you can wash your face violently like me <laughs> meaning that you know just like the neutrogena ad right we're just throwing water in and it's not going to remove or lift up your wig which i really like so this is also linked on my amazon storefront a link in the description box down below so you can check it out if you're interested if you you know want to try out a wig and you want to make sure you have something that can really keep you secure it's way better way better than got to be um got to be actually really kind of sucks but it is super handy and when i say it sucks like it's not the strongest if it is you want to be wearing wigs in the heat to make sure that you know your wig is not lifting and looking crazy i would suggest you use this one or the ebon hairsprays they are really good as well but i was all out y'all i have to make like a massive amazon trip like because geez there's so many things i'm out of some of my arabian sprays and such but say what guys i'm sorry i tried to like film but it doesn't work like with the rush and everything it doesn't work all the time but yeah we're waking again just for a little while so we'll see but yeah now we're off to church okay guys so my parents have this very fancy dinner to go to next week and my mother's looking for some jewelry some accessories girl i like i don't even know what to say but i kid you not the amount of money we spent on these accessories would have been the cost to buy about 25 earrings from Shein, as well as paying to clear it like the prices from one of her will is absolutely insane but it was like one of the very few places open in Trin City Mall like the earrings are like 65 the necklaces are like 145 look at that earring six dollars this is the one I'm looking at I find this is one of the best like the choices they have a lot of choices I can tell them that but um definitely not yes Niall I don't want to be in camera of course you do anyway 
So, you know, we just wondered what is best, but I did like this bangle and mommy did get some cute accessories. So, you know, that's good. But like $255 on three things is insane to me. All right. So my dad is also going with her. So we are going to get him um, a shirt. Well, in detail, he had one choice. Yes, we are his resident shoppers, but he's the kind of person he wants to check several different stores and see what's up. So we also went to Stefano's. I was very surprised they were open, but I guess it's grad season. But we ended back up in Ditos, all right? He really wanted a bow tie, and I really like this color. If you all looked at my last weekly vlog, I think it was week before last, for Father's Day that was, we went to, I think it's JNK Men, and we got him this really nice suit. So he brought it along to make sure that, you know, we match up the correct shirt, you know, with the suit. So, you know, they're going to be fancy. I love seeing them, you know, in the element, like dressing and just enjoying the vibe. And it was an, honestly a very cool family evening, a relaxing vibe. And now we are outside of Presto. My father went to get bread because he loves his bread. <laughs> so I am here just being goofy and crazy with my mother. Yep, that's me. So we're just here chilling and waiting for everybody to get back from the store but yeah it's just it's feeling good to just be outside normally on a sunday i don't go nowhere besides church so you know it was it was nice to be outside outside it's a long time for the nails the nails are looking so gorgeous in the sunlight it's a vibe it's a vibe it's a vibe it's a vibe yeah yeah now we are at extra foods in arima we wanted to grab a couple stuff nothing much because they already made like monthly groceries so we're just gonna get a couple things that naya really wanted you know these kids and my mother also wanted to get some stuff but extra foods was kind of like a ghost town which is weird because normally it's not like that but yeah guys that's basically my week i hope you guys enjoyed Thank you so much for watching. Thank you so much for always supporting your girl. I love y'all so much. Stay tuned. I have two other videos coming this week, including Naya's graduation. So don't miss that. And I'll see you in my next one. Bye, guys. Popular opinion number six. You only need one, maybe two foundations. Take it from someone who used to have 15 foundations at a time. Made absolutely no sense. About 10 of them I had to end up throwing away because... When are you going to get a chance to wear these things more than twice? It depends. Unless you're wearing makeup every single day. And that's coming from somebody like me. However, I still would not do that, right? I would at least take a day or two somewhere on the weekend or something like that as a break. But I'm telling you, like, even if you want to go with a tinted moisturizer for, like, everyday 